love letters. I thought it make me feel better. I finally got you home. Okay, girl, listen. When I tell you I am ready for this install, I am so ready for this install. This 24-inch curly lace frontal wig is from West Kiss Hair. And y'all, the density on this wig is 180%, so you already know what it's about to give. Full thickness, honey, and y'all know that's my vibe. That's what I love. So this is a 13 by 4 lace frontal wig. The curls come just like this. Now I have co-washed this hair and I did not do any plucking to the hairline nor did I bleach the knots. So what you see in this video, honey, is definitely what you're going to get straight out the bag. Love it, but I still can't get you on my so now that y'all see what the hairline is giving let's get right into the parting space so as you can see you get four inches of parting space and you get 13 inches of lace from basically ear to ear the parting space on this wig is pretty clean so I have no issues there and to make sure this wig is smooth and flat I'm going to be taking my hot comb and just pressing out the hairline like so to melt down this HD lace I'm going to be using my Eben hairspray and of course what I like to do is pull out some of the hairs around the hairline and spray the hairspray directly on my lace while pushing the hairs back into the hairline um, this just makes the hairline you know stay soft and it doesn't you know get hard or crunchy because you're applying holding spray basically to your lace so the last thing you want to do is have a crunchy stiff hairline so that's why I actually do it like this instead and now I'm going in with a pair of scissors in a zigzag motion and cutting the lace The lace has definitely been melted, so I'm going to go ahead and tie the wig down, making sure I put this headband um, more so on my lace that is cut, that's like at the beginning of the lace, so that it blends into my skin. So when I pull my hairs out on my hairline, I kept that out because I want everything to, you know, blend into the skin. So of course I'm going back in with my hot comb and smoothing my hairline out because while well, though this wig is super big, I do not need it to look like it's sitting on top of my head. And the key to avoiding a wiggy look is your hot comb, girls. So make sure you use it because it is your best friend. So, of course, with the curly wig, I'm going to be doing a bust down middle part. And I'm going to be going back in with that hot comb, girl, and smoothing out this damn wig. I finally got you out my bed, but I still can't get you on my head.
make me feel better I finally got you out my bed But I still can't get you out my head Ooh, I'm seeing you in one day to a time I know you by your phone So boy, pick up your wine this wig and I love the fullness of this wig so far now I know I have not I have not defined my curls just yet but the way this wig was giving when I was hot combing it and it was just big and fluffy oh my god I love that look but yeah girl so right now I'm just gonna go in and swoop my baby hairs in and then I'm gonna come back and show you girls how I define the curls on this big fluffy hair so before I start defining the curls I'm going to make sure I brush the hair out really good and then once the hair is brushed out I'm going to go in with this Cantu curling mousse I love this mousse I use this on my natural hair on my baby's hair for twist outs I just love this mousse and I'm going to put a little bit in this spray bottle which only has water but now it has a mixture of water and the curling mousse and I'm going to spray this all over just to get my hair wet um, and then I'm going to go back in with the curling mousse by itself to define the curls and like y'all look at the curls curling in this wig like <laughs> I knew this wig was gonna give what it needs to give like I knew that like look at this oh my god this wig is so pretty And then I did add the Garnier Fruities Curling Cream. Girl, I don't even know why I did this. Because, like, this hair don't need no additional products because the hair is going to do what it needs to do. Look at how beautiful. I, like, I don't even know if these are curls or waves or what. Looks like it's a mixture, like... Girl, this this hair looks so damn good. Like, I didn't even realize how beautiful the curl pattern on this wig was. Oh, my God. This is gorgeous. I mean, don't mind me, honey. I'm just replaying the video and seeing how beautiful this curl pattern really is on this wig. Okay, so now that the curls are defined beautifully and nicely, I'm going to go ahead and let the curls air dry. And then I'll come back and show you girls what it looks like 
once the hair is completely dry. <laughs> Okay, girl, I'm not even gonna hold y'all. I had somewhere to be, so I had to take my headband off and the lace is melted, the hairline is clean. Let me go ahead and define this part, honey, so it gives even more of a natural look. And I love this wig still, but it's still wet, so let me get out the door and I'll come back once it's completely dry. Okay, girl, I am back, and this is what the wig looks like once the hair is completely dry. I did not finger comb or comb out the curls in this wig. However, what I did do was I took sections of the hair and just kind of lightly, gently pulled the hairs apart just so that I can get a little bit more volume in the hair. And y'all, look at how beautiful the curls and waves is on this wig. I mean, like, honestly, the, the thickness is still here, but it's not as big as it was, like, before I divide the curls. But everything about this wig is so perfect. If you love curly hair or you want some vacation hair, girl, West Kiss hair will never, ever fail you when it comes to their curly wig. Like, they curly wigs is bomb, man. I'm not, I'm not even going to hold y'all. I'm not even going to lie to y'all. So definitely make sure you check out that description bar because a major sale is going on right now for Black Friday. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, girls. Yeah.